Unleash the Power of Pay is really about taking your payments to that next level. In other words, unleash the power of pay to reach next level commerce. It's an imperative for merchants. It's a call to action, if you like, to get merchants to really rethink and evaluate their payment infrastructure. Think about unified commerce. Think about omnichannel and apply that layered that layers of technology in order to give a much better experience to the consumer at the point of sale. I haven't seen anyone do a pastel analysis of the payments world. And I think the white paper takes you on a journey to understand what are the external forces that are impacting payments and the whole payment industry. So we've got the, poli the political uh, landscape, the environmental, social, technological. And I think what's interesting is to look at how those external forces are really influencing that entire landscape. And there are lots of different components that impact the world of payments. And if you think about just the way the consumer has changed at the point of sale, a lot of that has been enabled by technology changing. So technology has made it a lot easier for consumers to make a payment. It's given consumers many different options. It's enabled speed. And that's just like one facet of Pastel. So if you take other layers, you know, regulation, for example, is another area. What's going on in the world with Ukraine is another impact. All of this kind of layers on to make that change and to make the world of payments incredibly complex. But our job at Freedom Pay is to strip that down and make it a much easier landscape for merchants and partners to really navigate. I think what's interesting and for me what's lacking is still the story of what do we mean when we talk about unified commerce? What do we mean when we talk about unleashing the power of pay? And how is that, how does that translate into something that is tangible? And I would love to see some kind of innovation lab or some kind of 3D or virtual, virtual reality walkthrough just to kind of really illustrate what it is we're talking about when we when we describe this new world of payments. So that would be something I would love to see for the future. But you know, right here and now, I think very proud of Freedom Pay and that we're here in New York and competing with some incredible brands. You know, we have Google, we have you know Salesforce, NCR, Oracle. You know, big brands are here, and we're playing in this space, showcasing the value of Freedom Pay. I think is phenomenal. Um, so I think the show is really exciting. Thousands of people here, obviously wanting to know, you know, what is um, the next biggest, best thing that they should have. So for me, you know, clearly Joe is is up there in terms of, you know, the world's biggest retail show. I think retail is probably the most exciting industry in the world of payments, right? So the two converge, so payments and retail are converging, creating a really, really exciting space. Retail for me is becoming an experience. You have now what happened during COVID when we were all buying online. So the e-com was just exploding, everyone was going online purchasing, and now things are coming back in store. But what we're starting to see is that in store is becoming an experience. So people are not going back in store expecting the same as it was, you know, pre-COVID. They're wanting to have more of a white glove experience, whether that be more of a shopping, you know, experience with somebody in store, whether, you know, that's a shop assistant or the shop manager. They want help with, you know, really understanding the product, researching the product, all kind of in real time, sharing with their friends via social. So it's a much more immersive experience than it was five years ago. The growth of Freedom Pay is just phenomenal. And what we are seeing in the space and how we are driving the narrative of next level commerce and next level payments and this whole idea of omni-channel. And it really is kind of, you know, like omni-channel just five times. I think the concept of omni-channel for me is yesterday. And we, we have to start to think more around what do we mean by unification? What do we mean by bringing all of these different components together? And for the merchant, I think 
that would be you know gold dust if, if we could truly bring that to life and I think Freedom Pay will very soon so it's kind of like watch this space but I think we're going to be working with some super exciting partners in 2024 2025 and bring the narrative of the future of payments to life.